But so. So basically, mm -hmm. um, we like to think that the channel is where we make our videos, and the videos, of course, incorporate a lot of uh, different opinions that we see around, you know, that we read, fan reactions and whatnot. If you really want to know our specific opinion or reaction about something, come to Blog TV. This is where you get the, um, you know, what just what we think. Right. Just us. Yeah. Exactly. Exactly. Did you like Watchmen? <laughs> that was something that we were going to actually... Yeah, that's, the topics that's we, a topic main we topic we to wanted to, uh, to talk about tonight. So, uh, yeah. Uh, Should we get into it right now? I don't know. Is there anything know. else we need to go... Should, when do you oh, want to yeah. record this? Spoiler alert. Um, is there anyone out there who has not yeah, seen Watchmen good. yet? Yeah. Or Straight. hasn't read the book. Yeah, if you haven't yeah. seen it or read the book. You know okay. nothing about the okay. story. Okay. We'll, we'll do our best to, uh, to avoid spoilers then, if that's the case. Um, that's always tough. <laughs> yeah. Tough. We yeah. try to do that anyway, but you know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> try to do that with the videos. I hope we didn't spoil anything with our videos for you. Um, well, nothing that the comments didn't spoil. I suppose. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Not everyone's good with the spoiler alert there. I know, but um, let's see. Um, when let's do you want see. to record this? Start recording. It's actually already recorded. Oh, well, you hello. Because we're popular, it's the, there's a message that just showed up and said you are popular right now. We're featuring you on the okay. main page and I, recording I you. So okay. There you go. So there's that. This is mm -hmm. where you come to get our opinions. All of that. Mm -hmm. Hi everyone. Yeah. Um. So, Watchmen. <laughs> it's been about a month actually, almost since Watchmen has come and gone. Almost. Yeah. So, uh, and yeah, it, pretty much gone is unfortunately kind of the uh, the phrase to that best you know suits it right now. Unfortunately, um, because it uh, it's kind of gone from theaters in some ways. I mean, it's still there, but it's just. It, I don't see the TV spots anymore. It yeah. seems like we're not being reminded that it's out there anymore, and people yeah. have moved on to Monsters vs. Aliens or whatever they moved on to. Yeah, it's yeah exactly. It's like in the cheap theaters right now, yeah. and it's like it's moved. Uh, it's already moved to the dollar show. I guess maybe I don't know. We watched it opening night. We did. Um, we you know we try to catch every comic book movie opening night yeah. just to be with the the real fans to get the real the real reaction and really get into yeah, it with the people that care enough to be there opening night. Go to a big theater yeah. and stand in line so that we can be there and see it with all the um, the fans who really care about it. Mm -hmm. You know, it's kind of the experience. We go there for the atmosphere for that, too. And uh, there was some of that. It wasn't a hugely packed theater for Watchmen, but, um, mm -hmm. you know, I mean, the crowd that we saw it in, uh, I know some people said that you guys saw it in um, theaters where people laughed or, or snickered. Um, that didn't happen with our crowd, so, you know, I guess, I don't know, it just didn't happen when we saw it, so yeah. I guess everybody was more or less calm about uh, the whole thing. Maybe they knew about it, were expecting whatever it is they were going to see. Mm -hmm. um, so, yeah. Yeah. Reactions. You want to go first to the actual movie? Oh, or shall um, I? well, let's see. There's a lot of things that I that I liked about the movie. I really did like it. I really did enjoy it. I mean, I, there's a lot of things that I liked. I I think thought Jackie Earl Haley who just went above and beyond the Call of Duty in his mm -hmm. portrayal of Rorschach. Um, I thought he was just awesome. I I thought I thought everyone really did a pretty good job with their performances. Um, you know, uh, I know that there were some changes um, yes. in the uh, obviously the, that I saw someone talking about just now on the uh the talkbacks there that uh that uh, to the story obviously with the ending in particular which i didn't necessarily mind um uh, the ending change necessarily i did i yeah I there mean, was in the world of yeah. today you know right right they kind of updated to fit now uh, modern times a little bit better i guess i kind of i guess i kind of understood the ending i mean i'm, I'm hoping who knows that maybe in the I, I'm not sure if in the in the DVD they will include the uh, the original really ending. Really expensive. It'd be a really expensive cut. DVD uh, extra there yeah. if they did, but uh, um, but uh, I don't know. I think I heard a rumor somewhere. I'm not sure how true that is, but uh, there was that. I uh, the, the, one of the changes that I thought kind of I think is maybe one of the reasons why some people contributed to the talk about uh, Doctor Manhattan um, and his. Uh, 
pantslessness was the fact that um, in the book they they uh, they you know, if you notice in the book, yeah. his uh, his costume, you know, they showed it, made it more a little more clearer that his costume got less and less over time. Over time, it, you saw less and less of a costume. It was eventually to the point where mm -hmm. he just he was wearing nothing at all, and it illustrated his detachment slowly, more and from, more detaching yeah. from humanity. It and, made him uh, almost godlike in a way. Yeah, you know. And uh, the to the point where he just, he, it was just something he lost track of. He's like, oh yeah, clothes, I guess that is something. Yeah, for them, I guess it's important. And for them, maybe, okay. It was, it was just something that really illustrated that, I thought. But, um, I don't know. Um, I think it's also easier for a comic book to show nudity but not have it be offensive because you can draw the panels any way you want. You can have them turn a little bit or uh, be in a certain position where you wouldn't see, you know, full frontal nudity and still know that he is indeed nude. But it's difficult to do that in live action because actors are moving around and mm. it's much easier to, to have that slip on camera. <laughs> right. If you will. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know if you're going to find an interview about Alan Moore with Alan Moore on uh, on the movie of Watchmen, I just Hellion six nine zero one, because uh, I, as far as I know, he's has no plans on seeing it. It would I would very much like to know what he thought. It would be great to see, but uh, we have not know. seen Tales of the Black Friday yet. No, we, so no, we cheaped out on that one. Decided to bring uh, to wait for the uh, the wait, DVD. Wait for it to be incorporated yeah. with the uh, the DVD the it's, four hour DVD yeah, the, version or whatever the special edition when it comes yeah. out. Probably not going to be that much longer anyway. So, anything else for you? Uh, someone asked for the Rorschach voice. Rorschach's Journal, March 6th, 1985. So, there's that for you. Um, um, let's see. Quick side note Thank about... Thank you. <laughs> about Deadpool, everybody. I get a lot of requests about it. And, um... Just let me say this. The uh, new Deadpool action figure for uh, X-Men Origins Wolverine is not out yet. It will come out hopefully next week. Believe me, I am on that. Uh, and the only other Deadpool action figure that exists is the uh, Marvel Icons one, which is currently going up for about $150 online. It is very rare, and uh, basically he just doesn't exist out there yet. The action figure that he will have, which I'm not even that happy about because it's going to be about four inches, uh, is not on the shelves yet. So, how about I just say that? So, no. to keep everybody's mind at ease. Yeah. I, I see someone mentioning that's not Deadpool, that's Weapon X before he becomes Deadpool. From, from what I've seen, there is a Deadpool there figure. There is one, yeah. I know what you're talking about. There is a Weapon X figure, I guess, pre Deadpool. But I, as far as I know, I think they are making there a Deadpool with red, figure yeah, red with costume. the traditional costume, I think. I, I did see there's. So there's another one out there from Unless what I've seen. Amazon I've seen lied it on eBay. Us. So, yeah. You know. Unless they all lied to us mm -hmm. because we haven't seen the actual product yet. No. You're right. But, but we if have that's seen the case, if that's the case, that's even worse because then we're stuck with the two hundred dollar mm. Deadpool that we don't have to get. Or maybe mm. not. Right. Anyway, so tangent sign up. Back to again, <laughs> action figures aren't out yet. Back to Watchmen. Mm. Come on, it's not that irrelevant. Oh <laughs> uh, yes. Yo Riley. I know. <laughs> that's gonna all be right. a staple. Yes. Mm-hmm. Um Okay. Yes. Um, let's see. All right. I'll let's see. Um, Is it my turn. Spidey Mouse, keep an eye out. I think maybe some there might be someone out there to keep an eye on. Just to, in the talkbacks there, I'm noticing. Just to keep an eye on. Anyway. Is it my um, turn now? Yeah. Uh, a proper camera instead of using the webcam. We've considered it. We've considered it, but uh, I don't know. It's, they Maybe. don't really exist for Max. There are very few of those uh, portable cameras that uh, hooks up to a Mac, actually. Mm -hmm. We looked into it. Most of those are for PCs. Right. Um, oh, yes. I'm sorry. Go on with uh, what, what you thought of the... Uh, Watchmen? Watchmen, yes. Okay, well, I actually walked out of the, walked out of the theater thinking that um, it was probably as good of a film adaptation of Watchmen as we're ever going to see. Now, I say that fully aware of the fact that maybe Watchmen is not a graphic novel that should be, um, that should be adapted into a film. Like Random Guy said, it might work better as an HBO miniseries. Yes. Um, yeah, but so. they did try to adapt it into a film, and um, for the work that they did, I do appreciate what they were trying to do, and I think that they did an amicable job 
aja 